Today is hydrangea. The bloom in hydrangea is so wonderful. You can use this hydrangea flowers in your bouquets or in any of your uh, decorative places where you want to show the pretty. If you see this hydrangea, it's huge. You can't even catch with one hand. This hydrangea is called pinnacle hydrangea. Sometimes they call it as ice cones. It's huge. It's one variety of hydrangea, which is huge huge the beauty of this hydrangea is it turns into three different colors if you see here you have the white color and it turns into uh, uh, an ice cone color as well it turns into pink color the hydrangeas really help to give the garden a lot of wide varieties of big bushes. Hydrangeas are really have a peculiar kind of uh, taking care. Hydrangeas love the acidity. I would have given in some of my videos that this hydrangeas uses nitrogen more acidic loving plant and it is uh, having that acidity more and it uses the acidity loves acidity if they don't have an acidity in your soil it will die at the same time i would like to share one of my story of hydrangeas to with you this hydrangea is called mop headed hydrangea you would have seen this in lot of places with big blooming variety how to make it bloom was a big struggle for me for the past 15 years or i don't know like this is my mother-in-law's memory which we had in our garden i always used to think how do this hydrangeas can bloom so this blooming comes into effect only if you take care of it with good fertilizer so as i said if you see this plant this is acidic loving and it has got big leaves it loves the sun as well as it can grow in partial shade. But this one is right now on the east facing side of my garden, which has got a lot of sun. You need to drain the water from the root. So make sure you don't have a dump area or the damp area around you where it will take lots of lots of, of water and it will die but at the same time it needs necessary fertilizer to make sure it can bloom if you have seen this one see the huge bush still i did not get the bloom i found out a way how to make it bloom so probably by next year i will have some bloom also in this hydrangea the reason is it needs less uh, potassium or the phosphorus but whereas the nitrogen is needed more so when you feed this plant you need to feed with more acidity so I started giving lots and lots of coffee ground and as well tea um, to make it acidic also the lemon peels you can use it for acidity remember that the acidity level needs to be rate maintained to five to six for these types of plant if you don't have that acidity it will die 
if you have a good foliage it's good it means that the plant is really doing great only thing is you need to concentrate on how you can make it more acidity uh, for the feeding um, types so my point over here is for the hydrangeas what you have to do is uh, you need to have a constant uh, uh, touch on the acidic feeding mm, which helps the hydrangea to bloom i was thinking like you know okay i gave all my um, whatever i have the tea bags and uh, coffee powder i gave that is not enough the concentration is more needed for this plant so if you have some kind of uh, acidity which you can enhance to this uh, plant it really gives and really blooms very well so uh, think through the other type so if you see this pinnacle type of hydrangeas they are easy to come so pick the varieties in your garden which will enhance the beauty of your garden as well this is easy to grow as well and you can prune it very nice but if you see the leaves the foliage it is different than what i showed you the other ones there are limelight uh, uh, hydrangeas as well mountain hydrangeas have you heard the term mountain hydrangeas there are so many so hydrangeas give uh, all through the summer some beauty in your garden uh, please have that in your garden and maintain to have the beauty enhanced to your house See you soon in the other videos i would like like to give some more infos on the hydrangeas which i would be collecting pretty soon to on the feeding wise what exactly you should feed i would be trying to see how my other hydrangea the mop headed one will come and bloom in my garden i would love to see that blooming happen which is very pretty please don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell button to get the notifications whenever I load something in this uh, video.